I'm at the iconic Pierre Hotel in New York City. The hotel was originally built in 1930s. It's now managed by Taj Hotels. It just underwent a $100 million renovation. They've remodeled all of the guest rooms, public spaces, and event spaces. They also added a new restaurant and bar. Come in, let me show you around. We're now entering the pier's beautiful lobby. I love the black and white marble and the Indian artwork. It's gorgeous. Welcome to the Getty Suite. Thank you so much. This is the Getty Grand Suite. Like many of the grand suites in the hotel, they're named after someone who's been influential in the Pierre's history. This, for instance, is named after John Paul Getty, the oil tycoon who purchased the hotel in 1938 and owned it until it became a cooperative. Ooh, look, there's a terrace. The terrace is huge, and you can even see Central Park. I just called concierge and booked a personal shopper for a jaunt on Fifth Avenue. While I wait for her to arrive, the Pierre is waiting on me. Thank you so much. One of the main benefits of staying at the Pierre is that it's centrally located to many of New York City's top attractions. Its front yard is Central Park, perfect for a carriage ride. It's also located on Fifth Avenue, just a stone throw away from Tiffany's and Louis Vuitton. The Pierre's concierge whipped up this picnic basket for me for lunch in Central Park. The executive chef can make any meal of any type of cuisine for any time of day. He can even do gluten-free and sugar-free. It's pretty amazing. Their wish is your command. We're with the Pierre's executive chef, Stefan Best. Stefan, what are you preparing right now? Uh, we're preparing uh, one of our signature uh, salad, which is a Pierre salad. It's a mix of uh, fresh vegetable blanched and uh, seasoned with a little truffle vinegar. And uh, of course, as you might see, that's very sexy. I'm at the Pierre's private entrance to all the event spaces. There's really a natural flow through all the rooms. And look at these architectural details. This room is gorgeous. It's the rotunda room. I've heard it's the signature room of the hotel. These beautiful murals were painted by Edward Melkarth in 1967. He really wanted to bring the spirit of the Renaissance to the Pierre. The murals incorporate mythological figures like Venus and Neptune, and also 1960s icons like Jackie Onassis and Eric Estrada. What's really great about this room is that it connects to all the event spaces in the hotel. Through here, you have the cotillion room. These stairs lead up to the ballroom and the regency room, and down the stairs is the Wedgwood room. It also leads to the new restaurant, Le Capri. I'm savoring a view of Central Park from a grand suite on the 20th floor. I just wanted to point out the hand-colored wood engravings that depict different scenes of Central Park. They're hung all throughout the suite. Let's go see the bedroom. The master bedroom is truly an oasis of relaxation. You'll sleep like a baby on down pillows, Italian fret linens, and handmade silk fabrics imported from Bangalore, India. The Grand Suites aren't the only beautiful rooms the Pierre has to offer. They have seven signature rooms and four spacious premier suites that have incredible city views. Hello, good evening, madam. Hi. Hi. Lobby, please. Sure, thank you. We're at the hotel's main restaurant, Le Caprice. It's actually the sister restaurant to Le Caprice in London. They serve breakfast, lunch, and dinner seven days a week, and brunch on Saturday and Sunday. Right now, we're at the main entrance at Fifth Avenue at 61st Street. 
As you can see, it has a modern art deco decor. It smells so good in here. I'm dying to try the fish and chips. I heard they're to die for. We're at the new 2E bar. It's a lobby lounge by day and a great cocktail bar by night. Stay. Oh my god, I have to tell you, my stay was fantastic. That's exactly what we want to hear. So, when's the next visit going to be? Well, when I come back to New York City, the Pierre is definitely where I'm going to be staying. Well, that's what we want to hear as well. Well, can I get your cap? Please, thank you. Of course.